The home point has been updated. Please check it on the map. All right, what's going on, guys? So today we're gonna do a little range test. We're gonna fly from here all the way over there and see how far we can get the DJI Spark. And then we'll bring it back, change out the battery, and then we'll go ahead and put range extenders on to see how far we can get it. So I did this test maybe just an hour ago and it just started raining out of nowhere. You could kind of see blue skies. I think the, the ceiling was just maybe 200 feet or so, maybe 250 feet pretty low but um let's get started we're gonna start up the drone the drone is right here or a DJI spark <clears throat> all right sticks down and in <laughs> left the range extender a little too close go ahead and start recording on the drone itself kind of bright out here it's hard to like see my phone screen get some altitude here do a little spin to see what's going on here got some guys uh, fishing to my left right there Don't have shades. Oh, I'm looking right at the sun. All right, we'll just go straight up. We'll get this up to about 250 feet. You can still see it's kind of a uh, foggy out there. Uh, looking at 120 feet now. 120 feet above ground. Just a quick look of Prospect Park. Flatbush Avenue down that way. All right, let's just turn it back around. And let's go, actually let's get up a little further. We're going to fly to the other side of the park, which is roughly 2,300 feet. So right now I'm flying at 160 feet. Put sport mode on. And there we go. Actually, it's a little kind of, it's kind of high. I think I'm in the clouds. Kind of in the clouds here. It's kind of hard to see. It's kind of hard to see on my my phone. It's pretty bright out. But let's at least get to the traffic circle on the other side of the park. Thousand feet away right now. Height 160 feet. Traveling at 30 miles an hour. All right. Starting to lose image uh, transmission. Around about is like right over here. Let's increase our altitude a bit. All right, there's a roundabout. Get on top of that real quick. We got a drone out there. Yeah. Oh shit. Kind of see the traffic flowing there. Currently 2,600 feet away, 325 feet of elevation, just hovering. All right, let's look up a little bit. Uh, it's very white out there. <laughs> All right, so when the drone gets too far, your controls are kind of delayed, so that's why I'm kind of jerky. It's just a, the controls are pretty delayed. Still in sport mode, traveling at three, uh, traveling at 12 miles an hour, 324 feet above ground, 2,900 feet away. Let's bring up the speed a little bit, bring it up to about 25 miles an hour. Let's 
going pretty far today. I don't think I've flown this far. <laughs> 3,400 feet. This is, uh, what is this? The BQ no, Gowanus? I don't know where I am. Uh, Ocean Parkway. Ocean Parkway coming off of the BQE, I believe. Something like that. Prospect Expressway. No, I'm right. Yeah, coming off the BQE. Alright. Not bad. Not looking bad. Not looking bad. All right, let's fly a little more. If I, if it allows me, hopefully I don't disconnect. 2,700 feet away. Oh, sorry, 3,700, 3,800. And uh, signals just breaking apart. 4,100 feet away. All right, I think it's aircraft disconnected. So 4,100 feet away, aircraft. Aircraft disconnected. Aircraft will just turn around. There it goes, turned around. It is returning to home. We'll go ahead and cancel return to home. I'll manually fly back. Sometimes you gotta cancel it a couple times. <laughs> All right, this is like my fourth time trying to cancel this now. Okay, I'm in control. All right, pretty nice view of the park. I think we'll drop our our elevation just a bit here, our altitude, I guess. It, I mean, technically it's the altitude, right? You're dropping your uh, your altitude. Hey man, I good, but I woke up. You did not just tell me, look. You did not just tell me. 1700 feet away. <laughs> Doing good on battery. Um, okay, it says battery NA. It's not telling me the battery reading. It still has maybe 50% left of time. 56%, there we go. Alright, good. That was weird, the battery reading was NA for a second, but 56% battery left, so battery is not a concern at all. 500 feet away. Drone should be right here in front of us. There it is, right there. Got a bird crossing in front of us. <laughs> it came up on camera, nice. <laughs> all right. Take it out of sport mode. So will just bring it in nice and easy here. I'll put a new battery in, put the range extenders on, and try it again. I forgot what my distance was, like 4,000 feet I got. Uh, kids. I gotta be careful with this tree and these kids. Just protecting me. It feels kind of cool actually, like physically, temperature wise. Okay. Turn this guy off and put a new one in. Put the range extender on here. Three King range extender. I believe it was like eight bucks off Amazon. Not too expensive. Okay. Oh good, it, 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 it automatically linked right back up with my remote. Alright, we're, we're recording. Let's see how far we can get. Six down and in. That's cool. Yeah. <laughs> A camera? A video camera? Yeah, it has a camera on it. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Let's get up to about 300 some feet. Looks like it's getting a little clearer out. 
Definitely compared to an hour ago, you couldn't see anything. Let's get up to about 300 feet. Currently at uh, 240, 240 feet, 900 feet away, 31 miles an hour. All right, there we go, 300 feet, 305 feet, we'll cruise there. 12, 1300 feet away, 31 miles an hour. And uh, we'll go right back to that roundabout and check that guy out. Right. Here's the roundabout. Now I would definitely say the image looks way better. <laughs> it looks way better. I mean, the image is going to look the same for you guys because it's feeding to the SD card, but the, the image uh, on my phone, which is being streamed to me live, looks way better. And the, it's, the controls are better too. It's not sh shifty or anything like that. Currently 3,100 feet away, 30 miles an hour. I think I'm having myself a little seat. So previously we got 4,000 feet away. And uh, man, it hasn't broken up at all. There we go. My first, uh, my first break up there at about 3,800 feet away. Just past to 4,000 feet away. 4,200 feet. And now it's starting to get a little grainy. The, the video on my phone screen is starting to get a little grainy here. 4,600 feet away. Yeah, it's starting to get grainy. Maybe we could get the full mile in here. 4,800 feet away. A mile is 5,280, I believe. All right, 50, 56. Looks like we're going to do. Looks like it's gonna return to home now. Yep. No signal. There we go. Disconnected. Okay. All right, so we got about 20% more, 20% uh, more distance, roughly. All right, it's returning to home on its own there. I want to cancel the return to home. To actually like manually bring it back the drone and for some reason I just cannot cancel this let's get out of sport mode all right good we are good put it back into sport mode and I'll bring the drone back myself all right this is nice Cruising at uh, 31 miles an hour, 3,300 feet away, 300 feet above ground. That tall building there, that's Flatbush Avenue. Let's actually go and fly over Flatbush Avenue and see what's going on. A little bonus feature for you guys here. Still cruising at 300 feet above ground, 2,000 feet away from me. It's actually gonna fly and pass me to my left. So we're not gonna hear it or see it, most likely not. If I so happen to see it, you guys won't see it on the, on the GoPro. Kinda start dipping to the right here a little bit. Got McDonald's right here. I think we uh, deserve some McDonald's after this little test. So this is Parkside Ave here. Or uh, yeah, this is Parkside Ave. So let me actually get up and turn towards the drone. So we can actually get some better uh, signal here. So dip, look down a little bit here. So here we go, Flatbush Avenue. Take it out of sport mode and flow nice and easy here. Ah, whatever, put it back in the sport mode. 
outside of sport mode you're only doing seven miles an hour in sport mode you are maxing out at 31 or so rated i've gotten up to 33 or 34 in sport mode Flatbush Ave splits into, I think that's Washington Ave that goes straight and Flatbush bends to the left. And then this is Empire Boulevard that runs cross town, east and west. All right, signal's weak, signal's weak. I guess we gotta look this way to get our signal back. All right, all right. Starting to get a little weak over there. We got too many buildings in our way, so. Uh, Aircraft disconnected. No signal. Return to home. Take it out of sport mode. I do not want this to. Stop going home. Good. Stop going home. Wow, it is really foggy out here now. I can't see too much here, and it's really bright, so it's hard for me to see on my phone. But uh. Let's see. Uh, this is us over here. All right, once I can see these like blue boats, we're okay. Those blue boats you see there, that's what's right in front of me, the little paddle boats. All right, we'll start bringing down the, the drone. It's almost right overhead. I should hear it momentarily. Spin it around 180, 180 degrees. Oops, there we go, back it up. I hear it. There it is. There. Uh, take out a sport mode. Drop the camera down so it can look at me. See if we could get it land right in front of us to see if we're that good. You can see me there in the frame now. Okay, not in the water. There we go, perfect. And we'll just drop it right down. my kicks all right guys well with the range extenders uh, with trees around looks like you could get about another 20 percent distance it just ain't bad at all all right guys well I'm gonna pack it up if you uh, like this video make sure you let me know sub to the channel if you would like let me know if you want to see more drone videos and I will catch you guys later